to Fireball of Ruby's TV. If you want this look, makeup of course, make sure you stay tuned. <laughs> to Far Above Ruby's TV. My name is Jessica and today I'm going to do a simple fall makeup routine. Since this is my first tutorial of makeup on YouTube, I just want to make a disclaimer. I'm not a professional, I'm not perfect, but this is what works for me. I'm a self-taught individual who has um, been wearing makeup since middle school with starting off with eyeliner but over the years i have progressed so today we're gonna do a different type of routine and i'm gonna take you on my journey on this different routine um it's new to me it's been on youtube for like probably like last year and, and all that other stuff but i just want to try this new routine which is applying your luxury powder on your face before you put the foundation so powder before foundation normally this is like one of the last steps when you do your makeup but we're gonna try it first so I have to tell you I did my brows off camera um I'm not a eyebrow whiz um I do what works best for me I don't like thick eyebrows so let's get started okay so I'm gonna use my Ben Nye um, luxury powder and banana so wherever I put this on after my foundation normally, I'm gonna put it. I've seen some people on YouTube put it all over their face. My face is not oily. I have combination skin, meaning it's in between. It's not oily and it's not dry. It's in right in between. So I'm just gonna put this in my um, T-zone layer, which is gonna be here and under my eyes. I'm not gonna put this all over and hopefully it's a uh, flawless finish. So I'm kind of nervous, this is my first time trying this technique. So I'm gonna take you on my journey. So hopefully it looks right. I'm gonna use my Real Techniques Beauty Blender and I'm gonna pour some of this powder This technique comes last when you have your foundation. But since I want to try something new today, this is the first thing you do before you put on your foundation. I know it looks scary, um, but this is what everybody considers baking at the end. Now, I'm gonna put on my foundation. I'm not gonna really let it bake. Um, so I'll be using this Iman foundation. This is the Luxury Concealing Foundation um, liquid. I'm almost out, this is my second I, I bought this like two times. I love this foundation. I really want the Rihanna's foundation. Um, that's coming up soon as they give me the email to tell me that my color is available for it. For right now, I'm going to use this Iman. I love this Iman color. It does me no wrong. Put the foundation on my blending brush. And we're going to start. this in for a regular brush now to make this process a little more faster and so far I really like it it looks very very flawless already wow oh look at that I don't know if you see that Look, that is a flawless finish. That is a flawless finish. Wow, I may have to try this technique all the time. So we're gonna get started with our eyes first. 
I'm gonna be using this LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Warm Honey. And I'm gonna put this concealer on my eyelids. Just need a little, you don't need a lot. My eyelids are very tiny, so. That is like flawless. All right, since that's all in, I'm gonna take my crease brush. I got this, this is, I think this is e.l.f., I believe. I don't know, it's just a regular crease brush. And I'm gonna start with that champagne color that I showed you. So today we're gonna use this Special Occasions 39 color eyeshadow and blush. But today we're just gonna use the eyeshadow out of this palette. Um, this is a very inexpensive palette from BH Cosmetic. You can check it out on Amazon, or you can check it out also at bhcosmetics.com. Um, today we're gonna be using um, this purple color as the base. That's gonna be a pretty color as our base. And I'm also gonna use these two champagne colors as my outer crease. And we're gonna have fun with this. I mean, it's fall time, so we're gonna have a bold lip and it's gonna be fun, so stay tuned. gonna take a brown out this palette to make my crease a little darker I don't since we're using the base as a purple color I'm gonna try to bring it bring more nude to my face Take our medium shadow brush. I believe this is Elf. We're gonna go back in with the champagne color again to smooth the purple out. Then to save your life, I'm telling you with any makeup, you have to blend that base color in or it's gonna look really crazy. Foundation to kind of clean up the area that you just did with your eyes. Just need a little bit around your eye so it won't look purple. Clean this up a little bit. And that's going to be pretty much it. I told you guys it was going to be a simple. I could have complicated it a little more. But I just want to start off real simple for our channel. Add the concealer so we can finish up this look. Now I'm gonna take my MAC Mineralized Finish. Um, this is a little um, shimmery like powder. I'm not gonna put it all over, but since the concealer is leaving some like flashback, I'm just gonna just dot a little Mineralized Finish there.
black eyeliner under my my on my waterline and then off camera I'm gonna put on my lashes and I'll be back. I'm gonna use this black from Essence I got this from Ulta um, it's just a regular black eyeliner I'm sure you can pick it up at your local drugstore CVS Walgreens Walmart wherever you get your makeup any black liner will do all right so my lashes are on <laughs> my face is beat honey my face is beat so now I'm gonna take my ABH my glow kit and we're going to highlight our face is all and popping yes. yes so now we're gonna do a nice bow lip I'm going to be using the vamp it up I think this is yeah this is wet and wild inexpensive pick it up at your drugstore Walmart just it's called vamp it up 